So, uh, Chapter so, 7, uh, The Past Behind Us. Why didn't you come? Where have you been for the past two months? We did come. One night early. That was our mistake. Right. Hey guys, I'm Jinx, and welcome back to the black screen. I mean the quarry. Where we immediately hop into a loading screen. June 25th, Laura. So this, this is a flashback, right? Yep. So if you don't remember, because it's been a month. <laughs> um, Laura and Max, I think her boyfriend, showed up a bit early. Max got eaten by Dog Boy. And Laura got sedated by the uh, police officer, you know, like with a syringe. So now we're here. Max! I mean, he's gonna turn. Come on! He's still alive, but he was bitten by a dog boy. He is gonna turn, though, like Nick did last in time. Fucking do it. Oh, he's already turning. Oh. Yeah, he just did. That was it. He's a dog boy now. Sorry, Laura. Let's just hope the bars can hold him. Excuse me? The fuck did I do? I mean, what what did we do wrong? I am sorry I tried to fucking save my boyfriend from getting eaten alive. What have you done to Max? Shut up. <laughs> I can't just- Shut up! This is an interrogation. I ask, you answer. <clears throat> yeah, sure, not like I have much choice. Name. Laura Kearney. Who are you traveling with? And what is your relationship? Max Brindley, he's my boyfriend. Where were you headed last night? To Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. You already know this. What have you done with Max? No. I ask, you answer. That's how this works. Why is your mouth so weird? Fine. Again, it's not like I have much choice. Fine. What do you want to know? Oh. Well... Did you uh, expect me to? <laughs> why are we going to Hackett's Quarry last night? <laughs> Max and I are camp counselors. Oh, bullshit. Counselors aren't due until today. I told you, we drove up and got there early. We figured we'd just go to camp. Why didn't you go to the motel like I told you? Because we were, like, way closer to the camp, and we're broke. Mm-hmm. North Kill. What a name. Okay, Sheriff. Hackett. Wait. Hackett? Like, oh. Chris Hackett? Don't change the subject. What the fuck is going on here, Cop man? Is losing his patience. You have no idea what's going on here. Not a goddamn clue. You just stepped in some grade A double prime go ahead and kill yourself cosmic type shit young lady <laughs> and your only option is to buckle the fuck up and do what I say do you understand yeah. <laughs> we stepped into some cosmic type shit yeah man okay please please tr stop trying to intimidate me yeah sure Stop trying to intimidate me and tell me what the fuck is going on. Is, is Max alive? 
I mean, technically. I feel like I'm going crazy. What are you doing? I don't know what he's doing, so I'm not gonna lash out immediately yet. Oh, he just wanted to get us up from the chair. Okay. Let's go. Oh, <laughs> we stepped hey. into some cosmic type shit. Wait, wait, wait. You exploded into hey, a dog you boy. Asshole. Like Nick did. How, what, how are you what the fuck's going on? Max! I know you hear me! Okay? Yeah. I mean, I'm... I'm kind of all mixed up, but... More or less intact, I think. Path updated. Laura? Yeah? Why am I naked? What? That is a good question. I, I mean, mean after we got attacked... The next thing I know, I'm waking up in a jail cell and you're gone. And now you're back again, and, and, and I'm super naked, and there's blood and stuff everywhere. I mean, what the fuck happened? Yeah, so our host was very keen on getting me to confess, but I honestly couldn't tell you what I was meant to be owning up to. Jesus. What he used to try to get you to talk? The pincher, the blade? Three-hole punch? No, it, he wasn't torturing me. Who does this guy think he is? Well, Sheriff of North Kill, apparently. North Kill? Yeah. Max! What? Did you even look at the map? Hackett's Quarry in North Kill. That's the town. Oh. And it gets better. I gotta look at his name badge and... Oh, well, that's nice. Get dressed. What's he giving you? I'm not gonna be the guest of honor at Fashion Week, I'll tell you that much. Hey! Did I say you could talk to each other? Well, no, but I don't know how you're gonna enforce us not talking. Do I... Do I need to... I don't like either of the... I mean, I just, like, say nothing in this situation, because it's not a conversation, he's just... Fine, 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 fine. Sorry, sir. We'll be quiet. We will? Max? Hey, what'd you do with my real girlfriend? Well, I mean, I could also just be lying to get him off her ass, you know right, what I mean? Hands through the bars. Come on. Why? That is so uncomfortable. Oh, okay. So can can he transform into a dog boy Your and turn. untransform again? Let's go. I'm not going anywhere. We can talk right here. Come on. Hey, hey. Let's get go. the fuck off. Come on. Move. Good boy. Hey, stop struggling. You're only making it worse. Laura. I mean, what the hell did you do to her? Shut up. I, I just trying to fucking okay. survive here. Okay. Think, Laura. Think. Yeah. There's got to be something in here you can use. Maybe. I don't know. I mean, if it, it wouldn't be a jail cell if it was easy to break out, but sure. Also, yeah, I know we're being very compliant, but also, oh, 
what is written on the wall here. I will read that in a second. I know I'm being very compliant, but also, like, how is it going to help in this situation if you're not compliant? He doesn't fucking react well to being not compliant. We know that. So let's just fucking, like... He just asked a couple questions, literally just, like, three or so that we didn't have answers to, and we were thrown back in here. That's fine. So, you know, just... Relax, just chill, just keep While your cool. While the town of North Kill lay there sleeping, the hag in the woods started weeping. As the bodies decay, the wolves hunt their prey, and the sheriff continues his creeping. I mean, that sounds true enough. Laura Cell. This doesn't paint a particularly uh, favorable picture of Sheriff Hackett. And perhaps this isn't the first time he's locked someone up illegally. Well, I, yeah, definitely not. I do, however, think he's just trying to fucking... I don't think he's necessarily evil. He's just... trying to deal with this whole situation. I mean, there is that supernatural aspect of... the hag of Hackett's Quarry, who we've seen a, a couple times throughout the game now, but we haven't really had any big encounters with just yet. And then the wolves hunt their prey, which is, of course, the dog boys. Um... Which, Max should be one of them, so I'm a little confused, because especially that, like, him exploding into blood that we kind of saw, um, that should be, that, that should have been him transforming fully into, like, his dog boy form, like Nick, uh, like Nick did last time, but I don't know, he's still a normal... I mean, he sounded like a dog boy too. So can he transform back? Can they transform back? I don't know, I'm a little confused about that. But, I mean, the we know about the hag. Um, the characters haven't encountered her yet, not really, but we know she's there. The dog boys we've encountered a good couple times now. And the sheriff continues his creeping. Yeah. I don't think he's... Inherently evil, but we don't know his motivations either. Sis. I don't know. Oh, don't press it. Wait, 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 wait. I still there's still more for me to look at in this cell. Oh, I thought it was a button. <laughs> Not a chance. <laughs> Makes much more sense that it's something some to pull sort of out. Lever. Or a crowbar, or you know, like anything to jimmy it out. But yeah, I guess a crowbar acts as a lever to do that. So yeah, you're right. I'm sorry. That's that's handy. <laughs> that could work. Is that a spoon? It's it's the spoon part of a spoon anyway. The oh, scooping yeah, part. Do it. Okay, nice. Yeah. So what did I have? <laughs> Ooh, keep your fucking face away from that hole. What you find though? It, it seems like a place to hide something. Oh, that's smart. Put it away. Yeah, almost like it didn't move. Smart girl. You okay? Watch it, man. I bruise easily. <laughs> Give me a break. <laughs> Come on, man. You're being too much of a wise ass for the situation. Come on. Hey, the second we get out of here, you're toast, motherfucker. Sure. Second you get out. What is that supposed to mean? Well, that we're not getting out, or what? it's gonna be a while. What the fuck is that supposed to mean, asshole? Hey, you can't just leave us in here! Hey! Come back! Fuck! Son of a yeah, I mean. Uh, how is that going to help? <laughs> it's okay, though. Are you okay? It's just a foot. It'll heal. I meant the interrogation. Oh. 
Yeah, can't break old Max. Many have tried, many have failed. I'm being serious, Max. He, uh, he just asked a lot of questions. A lot of weirdly specific questions about us and where we were going and why and how I was feeling this morning and I don't know. Nothing I said made him seem any less annoyed. Yeah. He asked how you were feeling? Yeah. Why, he didn't ask you? No. Huh. Well, that's because you're a dog Rude. Boy. Maybe Max is, like, special or something. Like, maybe he can control the dog boy inside of him. Who knows? But oh, hey, did you get a look at his name badge? You mean it's not really Detective Dick Whippet? It's Hackett. Sheriff Hackett. You think he's related to Chris Hackett? Oh my god, like THE Chris Hackett? Yeah. Who's THE Chris Hackett? As in camp leader Mr. Hackett of Hackett's Quarry, remember? Man. Last night feels like a lifetime ago. The fuck does that mean though? You know? Were we set up? Maybe it's some kind of crazy camp counselor kidnapping ring. That's... I mean... What? I mean, if it was, why would they be... Why would he be asking you questions, you know? Some kind of setup. He's not acting like a kidnapper. Yeah, I mean, then again, how would a kidnapper well, I guess act? Sheriff like, Hackett's not exactly acting like a typical kidnapper, but he's not acting like a typical cop either. Yeah. Well, how do you know how kidnappers act? Exactly. I'm just trying to get us out of here, and I can't get us out of here until I have some clue of why the fuck we're in here. Uh, I don't know if that's. I don't know. What true. if we can't make sense of it? What? Well, we have to. Sometimes things just don't make sense. What then? We're just stuck in a backwater jail cell for the rest of our lives? This isn't forever, Max. You, you can't just hold us here forever. You didn't seem too convinced of that. You gotta stay positive. You can't think like that. Why not? Might as well just accept it, right? No, fuck that! Uh, dude, you used to be a fucking wise ass five Think minutes about ago. The what rest happened? Of the summer, Max, and school. I mean, I've been dreaming about becoming a vet since I was five years old. I'm not gonna let this flea bag fuckface stop me. Yes. First, we're gonna get the hell out of this mess and enjoy the rest of summer, and then college. We're gonna freaking crush it at orientation. We gotta get all our classes down. Laura. Did you look at all the options, by the way? I mean, it's a lot easier for me because I just need the classes that'll let me major in veterinary sciences. Laura. But you're undecided, so you have to make sure you get a really good balance of Laura. everything. Stop. Why? I I didn't get in. What? I got rejected from the wait list. Why didn't you tell me? If I may interject, why does that matter <laughs> right I, now? I was embarrassed. Wait, your grades were good and you wrote a great essay? Yeah, apparently not good enough. Fuck! You've been making plans, Max, what the fuck? I don't know, what do you want me to say? You have bigger problems right now. Like, I mean, it's not really a lie, you know? But, I, I mean, it's a very, uh, fine, it's a nice moment in your, but well, it's not a nice moment, but it's a moment in your relationship that you have to have, sure, this was gonna come out eventually, you would, ha you would have to talk about it, but, you know, maybe after you survive your current situation of being incarcerated illegally by somebody who may or may not be an actual legitimate, uh, Sheriff, after, you know, the day prior having been attacked by what 
you would have to consider it to be a werewolf because it wasn't a bear. Don't fucking come at me with the bear theory. That's not a bear. So, you know, you have bigger fish to fry here. Anyway. I'm sorry, Max. This, this really sucks. That updated my path. Hey, it's not the worst thing to happen this summer. What consequences is that going to have? I'm sorry. I shouldn't have kept it from you. You know you can talk to me about anything, right? Yeah. Like the fact that he's turning into a dog boy? Yeah, I do. Listen, man, all of this is very sweet, but this is the past we're in currently. And hey, in the future... Let's just focus on getting out of here for now. Great. Sign me up. We need to go over it from the beginning. Like from when we left home? Like from when we ran into the cop. So after we ran into that... Whatever we ran into? Yeah. Actually... Yeah, that's when shit started getting weird. The dude acted super weird when we said we almost hit an animal, you remember that? It was like he already knew or something. Yeah. Yeah, well, he, you hit a dog boy. Yeah, that almost. was really sketchy. What if he's not even a real cop? Well, he's gotta be dirty, but... I mean, I think he's a real cop. We're in a police station. I mean, yeah, but there's like... You're in a cell. Nobody else around. You don't know the building other than the cell. I guess he did yeah, walk you concerning. through it. Especially the whole hack it hack it thing. Let's just go with the idea that they're both in on it. Okay. So we're supposed to meet Chris Hackett at the camp, and instead, there's nobody there, and we get attacked by something, and then the cop shows up. That part's all fuzzy for me. Like, I, I remember the steps and a smell like wet fur and a dog boy a dog collar with the name ian on it yeah ian. dog boy ian i don't think it was a dog that attacked us whatever it was was big like person sized big yeah it really did a number on you like, so, like i'm surprised you're not more messed up like, like like i vividly remember the thing's teeth ripping into you what is messed up about that is laura i don't have a scratch on me what hey Okay, so weird question. Do you remember before we got lost? You got lost? Well, yeah, but before that, I was all like, whoa, look at the moon. It's so big, so cool to see a full moon in the middle of the woods. And you were all like, yeah, no shit, Max, it happens once a month. Yeah, so? Right, so. So, dog know, boy. Full moon. Yeah. What if, uh... Okay, no, stop. I'm just saying, you know, maybe there's a slight chance that you're a dog it was boy. a werewolf. Are you out of your? <laughs> why? Why did it cut to black? Goddamn mine! Werewolves? Seriously? Oh. Werewolves? Seriously? What the fuck? What? 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 What's so funny? I I said literally the exact same thing. Okay. Do you, you got anything better? I mean, like, zombies, aliens... He did turn right in front of you. I just Draculas. have, you know... Hey, time-hopping Draculas. You stole that from Rick and Morty. <laughs> Ryan, shut... No, here. She's calm. Ryan, She knows right? everything now. Yeah? You want answers? I've got answers. Interrupt me again, you're on your own. <laughs> Whatever. Would it really be so crazy? With all the shit that we've been seeing with Nick? With the thing on the roof? Okay, it would really start to explain a lot of stuff. Dylan. I'm just trying to keep an open mind, okay? This is like your ghost stories. How is this so different from your ghost those, stories? Those are, those are just campfire stories. Like, there has to be a rational explanation for everything, for all of this. Hmm, does there? Because okay, he did you transform not in front of you. Talking so rational when you separated my hand from the rest of my body. You told me to. And if it's bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. What? You did the right thing. See? She's got a whole poem about it. You're not looking so good, man. 
There's more to all this than you think. Just let me finish, then you can decide for yourself if you believe me or not. I don't care. But I think you should hear all of it. So what's in your eye hole that you had to show him so dramatically but we don't get to see? The next few weeks were long. The cop kept us fed and let us take showers, but aside from that, we barely saw him. Max and I, we talked a lot, as much as we could about what happened that night. It was like trading conspiracy theories. We talked about the cop, the camp, the accident, the woods, the thing in the basement, what happened to Max. We just kept going over it all again and again and nothing was making sense. All we knew is that we needed to get out of there. You were there for weeks, that's crazy. July 12th, oh boy, yeah, you've been there a while. I can't take this anymore. It's not that bad. They're probably in the same crap at camp. No, I can't take being in here anymore. Oh. Yeah, well, that part's pretty tough. We've got to do something. We've got to get out of here. We need a, p a plan. We keep saying that, but it's been weeks, so, you know, let me know if you have one. That's really not very helpful, Max. You are forgetting something. What? Just the ETBT tiny detail that I may or may not be a fucking werewolf, you Laura. <laughs> So what? What can we do, really? We run off into the sunset only to be stopped when I turn into a nasty-ass monster and kill you and eat you, and then I run off alone into the sunset with little bits of you stuck in my teeth? Okay, okay, stop. Just one problem at a time. All right, we, we don't even know if that's what's, what's that? really going on, and we won't until we get the hell out of here. I mean, it's a pretty okay. significant problem. Well, it seems to me that we only have two real options. We can play nice and try to get this guy on our side. What, so he'll let us go? Or... We try to catch him off guard and make our escape. How is it reckless to escape? Okay, so let's say we get on his good side. What then? Brunch in mimosas every Sunday till he sees the error of his ways? Yeah, I was being rhetorical. The dude doesn't have a good side to get on. I mean, he don't even talk to us half the time. I don't know. I think we could crack him. Laura, I think he's just biding his time until he can figure out a way to get rid of us. Permanently. <sighs> You're right. Escape's the only way. Hey, what's he gonna do to us that's any worse if we get caught, right? Let's just... not get caught. Deal? Yeah. Deal. Okay. Here's how it's gonna go down. Next time he opens your cell to take you to get washed up, you jump him. You tackle him down and take the keys from his belt, drag him into your cell, lock him in there, unlock my cell, and then we'll steal his car and just drive right the fuck out of Dodge. Right, okay, that's not really a plan though, you know? That's just kind of saying let's escape, but with a whole lot more words. No, he won't be expecting it. We're in a routine now, we'll catch him in the back foot. I mean, okay, but, like, you don't know if Max has his dog boy powers. So it's essentially just tackle this trained police officer. If he is an actual trained police officer, but let's assume the worst. And, you know, let's assume that he can handle a person attacking him, at least with some skill. Come on. Wow, he must have gotten really used to us over the couple of weeks because he's not even putting the gloves on ow. anymore. Ow, ow, careful. Really? Careful. Ow, ow, ow. Really? Exactly, see? The sheriff doesn't trust you. <laughs> yeah, thanks. No shit. Genius. But what about my shower? I mean, what did Set. you expect to happen? Take your fucking clothes off! Fuck off! 
Get oh. back! Max, what's going on? Get the fuck away from him! Oh, he's he's transforming. Come here. Get off of me! Shut up. Have a seat. Quit squirming. Whoa. Said you want to be a vet, right? Call us an internship. Hey, I wanted to Let make a vet go. joke earlier, but she interrupted me. You're not going to believe it until you see it for yourself. Just fucking ask next time then, dude. Jeez. Don't get too close. Well, I mean, you could have... Come in. What's your position? Over. Shit. Mm-hmm. Just wrapping things up here. Nothing. On my way. Over. That was pretty stupid. Well, I mean, it's pretty stupid of you to talk in front of us, you know? You do. You, you have. You. Hey, you can't just leave me here! Yes, I can. You know, you. Like, you've been keeping her in here for weeks. Like, why would you not expect her to try that? So he's about to transform. <laughs> Clinical, tell me what you're feeling. Nah, she's compassionate. Don't worry, Max. I'm here. Yeah. Yeah, right. Yeah, that might actually be a problem, though, because you, you seem right? a little close. Uh, yeah. I don't know. I just don't feel so good. Um, what do you need? What can I do to help? I was just hot. Are you hot? Oh, I'm kind of stuck next to this big-ass pipe, so I'm not exactly cool. Just stay back, okay? You shouldn't be this close. There's not a lot I can do about that, right? Well, you can scooch your body away. I mean, your arm will still be there, but, you know, it's the best you can do. <sighs> oh, boy, he is not nice. looking good. Max? Tell me what's going on. Oh boy. Oh, his teeth are sharp now. Did you just say wolf? Yep, there he goes. That looks horrific. Oh, music's starting. Fuck! Yeah, just be lucky that adrenaline's keeping you from feeling that pain, because you would not be that calm. I can't imagine. So is this the, she's turning into a badass <laughs> sequence? Is <laughs> 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 it for depth perception? Yeah, it, 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 it is supposed to be that she's turning into a badass sequence. Music didn't really help with that though. You just walked back into your cell. You were free. Oh, your door's still open, dude. Let's see what that bastard cop's hiding. How are you not feeling pain? <laughs> your eye is missing. Oh, well, we can walk around. I mean, yeah, that's exactly what would happen. But I would, I would have just hugged the wall. I still want to look at it. <laughs> 
Let's maybe not walk close to that thing. Okay, Laura. Oh, shit. Um, <laughs> um, we're gonna see what that bastard cop is hiding, but in the next episode. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Yeah, I just noticed, like, oh shit, I should maybe end the episode. I hope you guys enjoyed watching, and I'll see you all next time. Auf Wiedersehen. Dog voice saying Auf Wiedersehen too. Oh. Well, not properly. Auf Wiedersehen. <laughs>